Hello, welcome all the aspirants who wants to switch and build a career in the rig HSE, who wants to get a job in offshore and onshore drilling and work over rigs. Today, our topic is what are the job description, what are the nature of jobs and what are the duties and responsibilities of rig HSE officer, of rig HSE professional. Today, we, we will try to learn something about this. So, all the rig, the safety officer has some specific responsibility on a daily basis, which he m needs to be fulfilled. The number one, to work collaboratively with the on-site HSC team, frontline leaders in the operation and contractor management teams to ensure the HSC management system is understood and embedded at the front line and effective at achieving HSC performance. And the next is the key accountabilities include carrying out suitable training and coaching to build capability, conducting incident investigations to identify learnings and performing assurance of the HSC management system implemented to ensure it is fit for the purpose and meets compliance with the client's HSC standards and local regulatory requirements. And the next is to provide a strategic vision and technical support with the intent to build proactive HSC culture among staff and contractors, also with a strong focus on providing visible HSSE client HSC standards and regulatory requirements. And the next is to provide professional safety coaching, safety training, control of work coordination and competency assessments to RIC personnel, act as a safety coach on daily task, supporting the crew and management to raise health, safety and environmental awareness. And the next is ensure health, safety, environment standards in drilling and work over installation during drilling, site preparation, rig up, rig down and rig move, raising and lowering the mast, rig floor operations like making and lowering of BHA, casing, cementing jobs, well testing, fracturing, tripping in and out of tubular, safety meeting during crew change, pre-job safety meetings, routine inspection, rig and well site, preparation of site specific, specific SOP in local language, ERP, emergency response plan, risk register, preparation of job safety analysis, permit to work system, investigation and analysis of accidents, incidents and nearness. The next point is ensure compliance of company and client safety management system, environmental management safety rules and drilling safety standards on rig site, conduct and or assist drilling superintendent, rig manager with work site hazard assessment, health safety, environmental inspection, identifies unsafe conditions and or unsafe behaviors, provides recommendations for corrective action to line management and inform to manager HSNE of action taken to eliminate work site hazards. And the next is deliver HSC induction and internal HSC training and facilitating external HSC training where required and maintaining training matrix. Prepare daily, weekly, and monthly HSC reports. Conduct and participate in accident, incident investigation. Find out the root causes and immediate causes and prepare corrective actions to prevent reoccurrence. The next point is ensure the timely identification of HSC hazards, evaluation of risk for all activities, and development of effective tools to manage and reduce these risks to alarm. A lot means as low as reasonably practicable. Manage site interface with drilling and service contractors to op operationalize and ensure compliance with HSC standards. Maintain a high level of HSC awareness among personnel through communication, training, and promoting involvement in HSC programs. Demonstrate good safety leadership and behavior ensuring that the company safety expectations are communicated and maintained. And the next points are coordinate with the rig manager and area QHSC in charge involving HSC concerns. 
conduct daily, weekly, and monthly inspections as per the schedule, close out client audit point in timely manner, daily attending the drilling crew tour changes and participating in before action reviews conduct safety meeting, monitor and promote stop card system and analyze the trends and maintain records, routine checking rig floor, SCR generated area, mud tank, BOP, sailor, chalk manifold area, monitor the daily drilling activity and discuss with the tool pusher the risks for each whole section. Participate, support drills and exercises and maintain the records. Maintaining and updating rig evacuation plans, procedures and measures and paste it in proper locations. Provide information to management on accidents, incident in a timely manner according to established company and operator procedures. Investigate and prepare the report. Evac ex execution, reviewing monitoring of required HSC inspection for rigs and camps, reporting findings to the rig manager, lead and participate in drilling HSC audit, reviews and site inspection, maintenance of the corrective action, register card for non-compliance items arising from audits and inspections. And uh, some more uh, points which are very important. Oversee implementation of operational systems and procedures to include but not be limited to maintain work permit register, lock or tag out system, hazardous chemical MSDS, PPE system, H2S awareness and other required training activities. Maintaining all certificates of lifting gears, crane, forklifts, tuggers, etc. and also maintenance of the lifting and sling, slings registers and inspection program for rig in area. Monitor the rig contractor, non-hazardous and hazardous waste management. Rig HSC officer is responsible to maintain several registers like lifting gear register, corrective action register, stop cut summary register, periodic equipment inspection register, safety critical equipment register, rig register, training matrix and so on. Support the rig contractor with their HSE MS and ensure they have proper health certificates and fire training attended. Aware with the emergency situation and know how to respond. Cambos have first aider training certificate and efficiency and have the skill to operate the fire pump. So I hope that I could explain to some extent what are the nature of job, what is the nature of job and the roles and responsibilities of a rig HSC officer. So this was a little effort to all the learners and aspirants who want to make their career in, career in rig. Thank you very much for giving your time and watching my video. Thank you very much. Have a good day.